Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. It has been a while since I've spoken to you guys. The last time we met, ZZ had her sonogram and it was expected that she was gonna have maybe around three to four babies, four maximum. But guess what? It has now been six weeks since she has given birth. She gave birth on New Year's Eve and she had five beautiful babies. That's her behind me. She had five beautiful babies, guys, five beautiful babies. She had four boys and one girl, and today they're six weeks. I already gave them a bath, and today we're actually gonna be, do be doing their photo shoot. So today's photo shoot day, and I'm gonna introduce each and every one of them to you guys, okay? All right, so um, I don't know if I already told you guys, but she, in the event that she had like any girls, I would have um, kept back a girl but she only had one girl so it made it very easy for me um and this is the girl her name is Zena, and this is her so this is gonna be my keeper she's the one that i'll be keeping this is Zena. say hi she is miss pink collar and she's actually the smallest in the litter she's actually the runt of the litter actually so she's the smallest and she's the one that I will be keeping. Ooh, I love her. Okay, they're actually piled up here next to my feet, guys. If you saw this, it's, it's adorable. So this is them all piled up next to me. That's mom inspecting them. Um, I don't like when mom is next to them because they're fully weaned at this time. And so, yeah, this is them piled up and I'll be introducing them. There is one that actually is absent right now from here, but I will show you him. Hopefully he comes over before um, I finish filming. Come here, Zizi. Come here, up. Get up here. Okay. All right. So this little boy right here, Mr. Green Collar, Collar is Zorro. His name is Zorro. So meet Zorro. Mom is actually jumping up, trying to meet him as well. This is Zorro. Zizi, I'm filming. This is Mr. Green Collar. Let me show you guys him closer. Right? This is Mr. Green Collar. And something that you should know about Zorro is that he is the most docile in the litter. He is literally the most mild tempered, very sweet, antisocial, if you will. Um, but yes, this is Zorro. Let me show you Zorro's opposite. Zizi, come here. This, this boy. This is the biggest boy in the litter. As you can see, he's already like, put me down, put me down. This is Zeus. Zeus, say hi. Say hi, Zeus. Say hi. <laughs> this is Zeus. He is the biggest one in the litter. And as you can see, he is literally the troublemaker, guys. I kid you not, the troublemaker in the litter, this little boy. As you can see, he's already like put me down. Green was literally just like sitting there in my hand, but he's like, put me down now. So this is Zorro. It's easy, I'm filming. Let us meet Zane. This is Zane. Zane is the smallest in the litter. Look at him. He's the smallest in the litter. They all have the same red coat. That's what I love about this litter is that they are all consistent. Um, the same red coat. Um, pretty much they all weigh the same, basically. Um, just a slight variation. They all have the same teddy bear face. Um, but yeah, this is Zane. Okay, guys, it took me about five minutes before I found Zaire. <laughs> Literally, let me just check to make sure. Literally five minutes before I found him. He was hiding underneath the sofa. But this is Zaire. This is Zaire. This is Mr. Vice President. He is the second in command of Zeus. Zeus is the alpha, red. And then this is Zaire, yellow color. Okay. So let me tell you guys what I really absolutely adore about this litter. 
they are very consistent. As you can see, they have the same red coat, um, nothing different. I knew what I wanted going into this litter. I knew that I wanted very deep red puppies and I'm, I'm proud, I am proud, okay? Uh, they're very, very consistent. It's just their temperaments, just a little bit different. Even, the, even their size, they are literally almost the same size. Um, Zeus is the biggest one though. And my little girl, Zena, that I'm actually keeping is the smallest. As you can see, you can see the size difference. The size difference. This is the runt. And then this is the biggest boy. But yes, I am going to see if I can show you guys taking their photos because today is photo day. Uh, and then I'll be updating my website with the photos. Uh, they are all spoken for but one. Uh, they are all spoken for except for one. I'm not really sure which one yet because choices are going to be made tomorrow, Sunday. And yeah, I will show you guys my setup because I already have my little setup here. I have my tripod. I'll be using my phone to take the photos. And I'll be showcase showing you guys the finished product afterwards. Um, but that's my little setup right here. Um, I just usually put them on there and take their photos. I'm going to remove that cord back there, but yeah. Uh, I will take their photos and then I will see you guys in just one moment. If you guys are still here with me, make sure that you go ahead and subscribe to the channel. If you guys need information about toy breeds, for example, toy poodles, Maltese, Multipoos, the breeds that I personally breed, go ahead and don't forget to subscribe like this video, share this video to your friends, share this video, and also follow me on my social media accounts. I am on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, all the same name, at X Designer Breeds. Uh, okay, here we go with the photos. Okay guys, thank you guys so much for watching the video. I just finished taking their photos. As you can see, they're all piled up right now wanting to sleep. So 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm very proud of this litter. It is a blessing to have five beautiful, healthy babies. I hope you guys like that process of me like taking photos and stuff like that. I'll be editing them now and I'll be showing you each photo within this video. So stay subscribed, stay tuned for my next video. Okay, or check these ones out here.